Hi, Martin here. And have you ever had a blank page in Word that just won't delete? No matter what you try and do, it won't disappear. Well, this video is for you. I've created one video on this topic, but I had a number of comments on that one um, asking how this might look on the Windows version of Word, because that was on the Mac version. So that's what this video is gonna be, how to remove a blank page in Word on Windows. So let's get started. Okay, so method number one is the easiest method. It's the one that works most of the time. Um, and that is just to simply click on your blank page and then hit the backspace key. So like I said, most of the time that will work. However, I'm assuming if you're here watching this video that that method may not work for you. But I wanna mention it just in case anyone hasn't tried it. So if that doesn't work for you, let's take a look at the next method. Okay, so if method one didn't work for you, the next thing that we're gonna try and do is delete the thumbnail of the blank page. So in order to view our thumbnails, we're going ahead, going ahead and click on view here. And then from view, we want this show section. And from here, we're gonna tick on navigation pane. This will open up the navigation window on the left-hand side. Um, and from here, we want to click on pages. So now you can see that we can see our two pages in thumbnail form. So go ahead and click on your blank page and then hit the delete key. That should get rid of your blank page. So maybe that worked great if it did, excellent, but maybe it didn't. So let's head to the next method and we're gonna go ahead and check our paragraph marks and page breaks. Okay, so final method. So sometimes our paragraph marks and page breaks can spill onto another page. So in order to check this, we're gonna hit Control, Shift, and eight. So you should now see all of the paragraph marks, which may have occurred from pressing Enter or Return. And then what we can do from here is actually delete these paragraph marks, which will hopefully help us delete our final page. So we can go ahead and click on these paragraph marks and then hit delete. And then that should get rid of our paragraph marks. So I've got the final one here, but what you'll notice is that this one won't delete. So the reason that this one won't delete is that Word includes a non-deletable end paragraph. So although it can't be deleted, what we can do is change the size of the font. So if you simply highlight and then under font size, either here or up in the top bar, click on here and put 01 and then press enter. So you can see now that it's pretty much disappeared. So that will help us being able to get rid of the blank page. So that should help that paragraph fit on the preceding page. And then the final thing that we're gonna do is I have a page break on here. So I'm gonna double click on that page break to highlight it, and then I'm gonna hit delete. And now my blank page has finally disappeared. So there you have it, three ways that you can remove a blank page on Word in Windows. I hope that this video has been helpful. Um, if it has, please give the video a thumbs up. Uh, comment below if it's helped you and subscribe to the channel for more tech videos and tips. Thanks, and I'll see you next time.